Zadante, <laughs> Electro Ninja here, and welcome to the second video of today. And whoops, I forgot to put my ears back on. <laughs> oh, Frel. <laughs> Anyways, guys, welcome back to Electro Ninja Slab. Uh, like I said in the last video, if you watched it, this is the second video of today, and unlike the other one, which was bad news, this one is great news. Uh, now, I would like to just quickly say I am not sponsored, so do not think that I am about this video. Uh, I'm just personally really, really excited to talk about this, and... <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm excited. Uh, for those of you who aren't fully aware, I am a huge D&D fan, and I actually do plan to make a series in the future, I'm not exactly certain when, but soonish, I plan to make a series where I'm going to be talking about each of the different characters that I've played in D&D, &D, at least the big ones that I'm really a big fan of. Oh, excuse me. But... Something else that you guys should be aware of, because I have mentioned this in a previous video, and I think I made it show it some love for it, is that I love the amazing cartoon slash anime slash whatever you want to call it that is Dragon Prince. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, I love this show, and it's honestly probably one of the top tier shows that's coming out right now, and I absolutely adore it. The... <laughs> The Callum and Rayla relationship and Ezra and just, ugh, I love this show. <laughs> and also the fact that frickin' Callum is Sokka just adds a thousand, a thousand words to what I can say about it. But, uh, <laughs> why do they, why do I mention both of these? It's because there is going to be a Freaking Dragon Prince D and D like game, as in they are currently working on making a role playing game for this. Oh, for Dragon Prince, and I'm so excited. Oh, now just so you guys are aware, I actually signed up for notifications about this whole thing and i'm hoping i'm not 100 certain but i might be able to be in the open beta and uh, the open beta of this whole thing i'm not sure if it's open beta or what but it's a it's a beta um i'm not sure exactly how it's gonna work but i'm i'm hoping that i can actually be part of this and i'm also planning to definitely do a pre-order of this game and i am hoping that i can actually run this with some of my friends because i I'm really excited about this. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh, Dragon Prince. It like I said, it's one of the greatest series in the world. But one of the things that I was kind of thinking when um when I was first watching the show is, you know, this would make a great MMO or a great tabletop game. And what the <laughs> They actually did it, and they're doing it. As of right now, the pre-ordering is available, and um, I'm hope I'm hoping that I actually sh uh, by the time this video sh came out, I'm hoping that I actually shared the link uh, on both uh, on all of my social medias. If I haven't, then shit. But it will also be in the description down below so that you guys can actually go and check this out. Uh, this is just going to be the Facebook link that I saw. Um, I'm not going to be post, uh, I want you guys to actually read that first and then read the information that they have on it on their website. But <laughs> needless to say, I am ecstatic and you could absolutely expect me to be purchasing this game and then playing the crap out of it with my friends and having them all create their <laughs> their elves or their humans and trying to figure out a cool little game that we can all play and i 
<laughs> oh boy, I'm I'm excited. Just needless to say, I'm really excited to see how this story continues. One of the big things about this series is that it's not necessarily very similar to D&D and other games like it. One of the big issues is that you have to actually... Uh, it's a war. There's a war going on. You're not facing off against, like, monsters or whatever. You're facing off against real other... Or, other people and it's insanity <laughs> yes there is peace now in the move or in the show but yeah uh i'm not exactly certain exactly what they're doing i from what i'm understanding it looks like it's gonna be taking place after um ezra actually unites um the two uh, the elves and the humans back together or at least he's attempting to work something out between the two um, and basically you're going to be playing as a group of elves and humans who are going after the creations of a lot of bad people. <laughs> Specifically, you're going to be going after, um, uh, why am I forgetting his name? Holy crap. Viren. You're probably going to be going after Viren and Claudia, just trying to find out what they've done and fighting off all of these dark magic beings that they've created and have corrupted. And honestly, I'm just excited to see how this is going to go. I do not think that we are actually going to be responsible for taking down Viren and Claudia in this entire thing. But I do think that we will actually still be involved to a certain degree. And on top of that, I'm so excited to see how things are actually going to be playing because... This isn't really a D&D like thing. There are those who can use magic and those who are warriors. So I'm wondering exactly how they're going to be doing these things. Are we going to uh, um maybe if you're learning some uh, if you're learning wind magic, for example, like you're going to be a wind elf. Uh you can you'll start off by doing the um you'll uh, as you'll learn aspro first, then you'll learn the lightning spell. And then you'll continue to go on and on t until you eventually get Mage Wings, <laughs> which just sounds awesome unless you are someone who actually has those wings from the beginning. And in that case, then you'll have a different spell and learn to use other magics. I don't, I don't know. Um, on top of that, I, I, I have no idea what we're going to be learning with the other spells because... So far, the only spells that we have actually seen Callum do are wind spells. And I think, I kind of doubt that humans will be able to do much with magic. But if they are someone who is going to be like Callum, who can use magic just like him, then you'll be able to learn all the different classes of magic, and that excites me beyond imagination. In case you haven't noticed from this video, I have been smiling the entire time that I've been talking about this, and needless to say, I am really excited for this. Um, so, I, I want to know what you guys think, what you think is going to be going on in this whole series, because I am going to be... I, I, I don't usually do D&D-like videos, but honestly, I kind of want to to make this into a series once it actually comes out and I want to actually be able to talk to people about this and invite my friends to be in this game and we're gonna just I'm excited needless to say <laughs> we'll see how things go exactly but yeah <laughs> Anyways, guys, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. <laughs> I know that things have been a bit crazy and stuff, but honestly, I think that you guys probably all enjoyed it. So if you did, please make sure to leave a like. And of course, leave your thoughts and theories down in the comments below. Uh, if you are going to leave a theory, make sure to say theory review somewhere in your comments. And of course, if you are new or you just haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe and ring that notification bell because, yeah, we're going to be talking more about the series in the future. 
And then also tomorrow we'll be back to the miraculous videos. So look forward to that. But anyways, guys, I have been Electro Ninja and I will see you guys next time. But on.